Yeah, so I think we're going to get started. So we have plenty of time to hear from Debbie and Kelly. So um, I'm going to um, turn it over. I'm going to ask you all to put yourselves on mute and please raise your hand if you have questions for Debbie and Kelly as we go forward. Um, and then we'll kind of open it up later. Um, I am going to turn it over to Brandon, who's mm -hmm. kind enough to do our introduction today. So Brandon, take it away. All right, thank you. Hello, everyone. Today, I have the honor to introduce our star athletes that represented Connecticut at the Special Olympic World Games in Berlin, Germany. Athlete number one is a year-round athlete that has competed in many sports for 17 years and has earned recognition from the Connecticut Interscholastic Athletic Conference and Bud Myers Award throughout her career as a Special Olympics athlete. Outside of Special Olympics, this athlete is a world traveler that has adventured to a lot of places around the world. But I bet no adventure will be better than representing America at the Special Olympic World Games. Let's hear for Special Olympics new Milford athlete, Kelly Schneider. And athlete number two is what I like to call a golden athlete. This athlete has been with Special Olympics for 34 years as a unified partner and a coach and has earned a lot in her career and a, um, earning the Outstanding Coach Award. Award Unsung Hero and was inducted into the Shriver Society. Also, not only did this athlete compete at the Special Olympic World Games th this year, but also competed at the Special Olympic World Games here in Connecticut and the USA Games in Nebraska, and also coached the Connecticut bocce team at the USA Games in Iowa. Outside Special Olympics, this athlete is a retired employee from the Connecticut Department of Developmental Services that has also had and has also earned the Governor's Service Award, a high honor in state service and is a proud wife and mother that has a child following her footsteps as a unified partner and coach. Give it up for your golden unified partner, Deborah, Debbie Albers. <laughs> Thank you. That was nice. That was fantastic. <laughs> okay, we're going to spotlight our two guests here. There. Does Kelly have her medals on? Because I no. know. <laughs> No, they're hanging up in my room. I didn't bring mine down either. But yeah, I have pictures. You, you want me to share know. pictures or how are you going to do this, Deb? Sure. I can make you a co-host and you can kind of tell us a little bit about your experience. And then I know that um, some of our athletes sent some questions to you in advance. So I can either read them or you can read from them. Um, and then we can open it up to additional questions at the end if you'd like. How does that sound? Sounds fine to me. All you good, right. Kel? Yeah. And as we start out, I just like to congratulate you guys. I haven't had a chance to see the two of you. You've done, you know, it was amazing what you guys did at World Games. Right. Brought great, great honor to yourselves, to your families, and certainly to the Special Olympics family here in Connecticut. So mm -hmm. um, we couldn't have asked for two greater people to go represent us at the, on the world stage. And Deb, I don't know, 34 years with Special Olympics. I think you and I started when we were 10 years old, maybe. Wow. <laughs> there wow. before you. I think I remember you coming on. <laughs> but yeah. hey, good to see you, Mike. Beautiful wife. Good to see you, Mike. Yeah, hi, Mike. I'm, I'm honored to, I just really wanted to hear about your trip, and I don't want to steal your thunder, but I did want to um, <laughs> congratulate both of you personally. Thank you. Appreciate Thank you. it. Hi, uh, Mike. Me. <laughs> I didn't hear that last part. Oh, I just uh, unbelievable. Uh, I'm so excited to be able to share and see what, you know, some of your pictures and hear some of your stories uh, from an amazing event. So looking forward to it. Thanks. <laughs> Did you want me to show pictures? Sure. I don't know how you want to do this. I think, but I think you can share screen. I made you a um, co-host. Oh, she has hard copy pictures. I do. Well, because I'm going oh, to make myself a uh, scrapbook. So I went to Walmart or I did it online. 293 pictures I printed out. 
I could get my book. You could get your book. Here's Kelly and I earning our gold medal. Oh, congratulations. And you guys are like Kelly. You I guys are you. like rock stars right now. We oh started God. right off the bat with a gold Super. medal. I think we were in two days or three days and we got our gold medal. All <laughs> yeah. right. I like the uniforms. Those are cool. Oh, if you want the shirt, I'll give it to you. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's all right. I got plenty. <laughs> Still trying awesome, to get Awesome, Dev and Cal. Oh, here's that's a, nice. Here's picture. another one. That's with our bronze medal. We came in third when we did um, doubles. The gold Ooh. medal was when we were the four person girl team, and then this was our our double team. Wow. Yes. Wow. For That's bowling, awesome. in case you guys didn't know, we went for bowling. <laughs> yeah, I'd say, I, I, I'd say I, I say saw, I saw the preview. I say I saw the preview doing it. I think I saw you guys walking out and everything else so you guys had your hands up and everything else so you guys i tell you you guys came a long way from connecticut and went all the way out to another country to compete with a whole bunch of people from all around the world there were 170 other countries there wow yeah, yeah. and deb i actually um did my new sport now I'm doing is bowling for a Special Olympics. Connecticut. You're doing bowling? Good for you. Yes. I should start this. So my first Maybe year, I actually got next. second. <laughs> <laughs> and here's the whole team, the whole Connecticut, the whole USA bowling team. Mm. That was Anybody else I know of? I don't know where I'm supposed to hold this. I that was before perfect. we went into opening ceremonies. Oh, Kelly's better at all this kind of stuff than me. <laughs> <laughs> you guys must have been tired, though, from your flight, though, and everything mm -hmm. coming back. Yeah, how long did it take us, Kelly? Seven uh, hours? Felt like forever. Yeah. A long yeah. flight. Well, mm -hmm. she slept, so it didn't feel that long for her. I, of course, did not even sleep an inch on that thing. <laughs> on the plane. <laughs> so I was up, I like, 28 hours straight. Was it an overnight flight? Yes. It was. Yeah. Did Tell them what we did before we went to the plane, Kel. No, I don't. Or, mm. At the hotel? Yeah. That we, we found stay? the pool? <laughs> you could kind of skip that part, but you can tell them where we went. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. The TSA hotel? Yeah. With all the old phones? Yeah. Oh, we wow. Put us up at the TWA hotel at in New oh, York wow. at the airport, and it was mm. like a museum. It had all the old stewardesses' dresses, oh. all the years they wore oh. it. The old plane was there. We got to go on that. They had the bar. They, it was they turned it into a bar, and no what kidding. else? Oh, the phones. They had the rot rotary dial phones. Oh, wow. You remember that. Like, they had pay phones. And I think they actually still work. This was at the hotel, Dad? Yeah, that was at the hotel before we even went to Germany. What was the name oh, of the hotel you stayed at? TWA. Oh. oh. Okay. Yeah, and that was fun. And then Kelly and I got off at the wrong floor, not on purpose. To go and check out the big, huge pool that was on top of the roof. What? <laughs> we swear we did not go swimming. Oh, you guys should have went swimming. We were just ready to go up there. We just happened to get off the elevator on the wrong floor. Oh. Uh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was tempting. Fun. Yeah, it was tempting. That was fun. That was a nice, that was a really nice hotel. I would definitely go back there. That has been beautiful. Wow. Yeah, it really was. That was fun, huh, Kelly? Did they feed you guys and everything also? Yes, they did. All the food was included. In my... The, was the food really good? I would say not really. <laughs> it was it was buffet food mm. from the hotel. Yeah. <laughs> So we did get to go out one night. They took us out to a nice German restaurant and we did get to try some German food. Ooh, yeah. That's fascinating. Wow. Yeah, that was nice. That was good. Wasn't that I did send you a list of questions through email. I just sent it to Debbie Horn. Yes, I think we got them. Oh, good, good. I did not print them out, so I don't have them in front of me. 
No, I think when you guys, you know, kind of tell us a little bit when you're ready, just let me know, um, you know, after you tell us a little bit about your experience and I can go through them. Well, oh, there's well the... let me just, I'll finish sharing my pictures. Like you said, we had two hours, so I was kind of going to. Oh, one hour. <laughs> one hour. Okay. Well, I do. I showed you how we went in. This is Kelly eating a big, huge pretzel. <laughs> oh, oh, that's God. huge. Wow. Wow. Okay. Did you finish it, Kelly? You go, yes, girl. I did. I oh my gosh. Did. It was pretty good too. Yes. They gave I hope it, you took well, lots of mustard for it. <laughs> I don't think they gave us mustard. No. It was just but, and then they had these guys at opening ceremony. This is a German man in his later hosen. Oh, oh nice. Cool. Oh, oh I see those, yes. So they were there doing some dance. This is the group of them. <laughs> Sounds fun. That was what we saw. And then they had, I don't know if you guys have heard of the Blue Man Group. Yes. Oh, yeah. I, yes. I, heard I met them in person, though. Yeah. yeah well, so I, I, me. They were there at opening ceremonies. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. Yeah. So that was that. And then this was the, um, I don't remember her name. Mascot? The mascot. Yeah. yeah. It was, she had a it's name. Hard. I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember. I think it was Unity, I think. Mm. It was all Unity. So this was the mascot for the for the opening. How um, long were you guys in opening ceremonies? Was it a really long time to wait to go through opening? Yes. Oh. Um, I think we had to be there in the afternoon. I think we were there late afternoon. And then we didn't get yeah. in until uh, like 8 o'clock, 7 o'clock. Yeah. Wow. You guys must be tired. Yeah, there was oh. a lot of um the other countries had beautiful um like Africa came and they had all their African wear. They had these big beautiful hats and yes. and were doing dances. I saw I saw that though. I saw I saw the I saw when they did the parade when they did the whole parade though and everything else and they had like yeah. all different countries were all different colors. Yeah. It was awesome. It was awesome. Yeah. And the people from Ukraine, they were there. So that was kind of nice. I think I didn't hear that they got a big, huge applause when they walked in, but because I didn't see them, they were ahead of us. Mm. But anyways, this is where we, this was our first uh, town that we stayed in. It was called a wow. It's like so Buckingham we, Palace. I know. And that was just one of the buildings that was huge. in the little town of Bremen. Wow. So when we got the airport in berlin they put us on a bus for seven hours to go to this town and we stayed okay. there for two or three nights what a beautiful okay. town and we got to practice bowling there and then we got to tour this whole entire town this was our favorite i think and then oh, we took the bus seven hours back to berlin <laughs> so that was kind of rough and here's another part of the of that little yeah. town of freeman oh, oh. Wow. beautiful here's the, here's the picture of the rooftop Hotel. Oh, oh no! Nice. Oh, cool. 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 Yeah. How was the hike up there? That was a nice cool. cool. That was a highlight. Trust us. Yeah. You want to share something else, Cal? I did, but then I lost it. Okay. <laughs> I'll show this then. This is the um, Brandenburg Gate. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So okay. this is our whole bowling team underneath that and this is also where they had cycling so the cycling venue went yeah. through the gate yeah. and around the gate and then down the road and then back up around so oh yeah the tour de france yes yeah. yeah oh no yeah. no no the tour de france is not in here yeah, this is france. in germany okay oh. no so, so, yeah. cycling no. venue that trish stapleton she's also from connecticut she was the assistant coach i know her i know her well, she was the coach for cycling, and this is where her venue was. This is where the cyclists were. Oh, oh nice. It's a pretty famous um, um, gate. Like, Napoleon came through it at one time. I mean, it's it's hundreds and hundreds of years old. Mm. Uh, did they yeah. have, like, a track or anything there? Or just no, That was a road. They just went around the road. Oh. And then we had closing ceremonies at this gate. I see. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of fun too. What do you got, Kel? I said I found that the picture of the alligator. <laughs> oh, really? A real there one? You go. No, it's definitely not know. real. Oh, thank okay. God. That's cool. Wow. Wow. How is Lori Jean? Yeah, Lori Jean was there too. We saw her. We went 
been with her at opening ceremonies. I know her because I've seen and, her before at Special Olympus. Yep. This is the Berlin Wall. Oh, oh, oh that's oh, cool. Oh, yeah. So now they paint it so it looks nice and it's not just a cement thing. But we saw this when we took the bus to the bowling venue because it was pretty far from our hotel. But we and got all walked around this. What'd you say? Oh, you managed to get it on the bus? Yeah. No, this is when we walked that day. Remember when she made us get off the subway and walk? <laughs> so I took these pictures. Oh, and What's here, that? Th this is cuckoo clocks. Oh, oh there you go. Okay. I have one in my um, house. In my, um, you do? Yeah. Yeah, well, this is where they're made, over in Germany. I don't know where my camera is and where I'm supposed to wow. hold it. But this was in a store that we went into, and I was just amazed that all these clocks were on the wall. Mm. So some of them were $200, and some of them were $2,000. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh. And then here's the beer steins that everybody talks about in Germany. Oh, beer. Oh, wow. But you can buy oh, yeah. those. So those were also in the same store. And I can't remember. I think I, because somebody wanted me to get them on. I think one of them was $60 and the, they go up to like $400, $500. Oh, didn't man. you get them for Trish? Yes, she wanted two. So I got her two. $60. Yeah. She didn't want did the you, big did you guys? Did you guys try any, did you guys try any beer over there, over there in, in Berlin? No, we did not. Ah. What's the rule yeah. in Special Olympics? No drinking, right? Yeah. Right. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do they have like a special so lies when you go over there too? <laughs> they have a special chair where they go zig a zig a zig a zig a hoi hoi hoi. Did you do that? Hmm. No, I don't know who. Uh, I, I learned that in Disney World Australian when I was though. there. Sounds Australian. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. I they yeah. didn't. I didn't see anybody do that. I uh, have aunt. Well, my ancestors was actually was from Germany. Yeah, oh, really nice. Yeah, mm -hmm. I liked Germany, I, and I would go back to Germany. I don't really feel like I have to go back to Berlin because I we when we weren't bowling, we were sightseeing, so we really saw everything in Berlin. I don't think we missed anything. That's oh, that's crazy. good. Yeah, we had some really nice coaches that would just let us take us out and go. We couldn't go by ourselves, but. They would go with yes. us, and we all got yeah, along, an so it was fun. Mm -hmm. See, me, I would have been if if I was in if I was in Berlin over there. My first my first thing would be like I would be like finding the scooter that I saw that they had over there in Berlin, like take it out for a nice tour, and then figure out exactly what else is there and everything else. So because I tell you, I would be having so much fun. I would be taking. <laughs> sightseeing and everything else so we had so much saw those scooters everywhere but we weren't allowed to go on them uh, man. <laughs> <laughs> wow so, so anyway deb uh did you try to get like any german chocolates or anything there i don't remember trying any german chocolate kelly did we does, does lint count oh wow that sounds good <laughs> <laughs> We did buy chocolate in the Lind store, but I think that's Swiss Switzerland. I don't think we did, Allison. Oh, before we even left from at the TWA place, they gave us like four bars of chocolate from there. <laughs> oh so my goodness! So much chocolate, but of course oh, it was yeah. but it was New York chocolate, but it was still good. Because <laughs> when I went to Epcot right, at Disney World, chocolate. they smelled their chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, I don't. I don't remember trying any German chocolates. Mm. They were talking about the chips. Too many. Yeah. Kelly had a big, huge chocolate donut. Oh, yeah. oh my goodness! Was it like How big, big, Kelly? It was really good. <laughs> was oh, it good, Kelly? I totally have a picture of it. Oh, I let me see yeah, this donut. Huh? It was like a dessert. Oh wow! Uh, wow. I'm impressed. I didn't see the picture. She's looking for it. I'm going to get sugar wash. That's true. That's true. You have a little screen. Be in that thing up in there. Did you say bye? 
Did they have like Olympic Town or Healthy Athletes there? Yes. They did. Yes, we yeah, we did both of those. Kelly got new eyeglasses. Oh, <laughs> right. I know. Boom. Not telling you if I'm wearing them. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> this is the massage I got. Oh, oh my nice. Goodness. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Still, still trying to find the donut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I keep looking for the donuts. <laughs> I don't have a picture of that. Kelly and the, the land of the coach that did that. See now the first see now the first thing you should have did is like before before you started eating the donut, you should have took a picture first. That's what we and, did. They did oh, do that. did. After okay. they showed it to us. Okay. Yeah, one of my favorite German things is, is actually sauerkraut. I don't really eat sauerkraut. No, I don't like sauerkraut either. I love sauerkraut. I'm not a big coleslaw mm -hmm. person either, so I don't like sauerkraut. Oh, you found it, Kelly? Can I see if I my phone now? Hold it up in there. Oh, oh dig it. Wow. 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 No. Yeah. <laughs> It looks delicious. It was like it a dessert. Mm. I, I, I tell you one thing. I tell you one thing. What a big big donut like that though makes Dunkin' Donuts really jealous. Oh yeah, it sure would. It was better than Dunkin' Donuts. Oh. Was it? <laughs> oh, it was. Uh, <laughs> did the sugar help you with your competition? Tell us about phone. your competition. Did that give you like a lot of energy to compete? What was that like? The yeah. wait, say that again. <laughs> Tell us about your co competition when you were bowling. Did the sugar help you? Did, <laughs> did that, oh, that was that? I, was tough. What were the competitors yeah. like? Mm -hmm. oh, competitive. Mm -hmm. um, Everybody bowled really well. Don't do it. Mm -hmm. What was that? What was the highest score that you got when you got when you got the um when you got third third place in uh, bowling? I don't remember what I got in third place, but my highest game was a 186. And Kelly's, I think, was a 156, wasn't it, Kelly? Yeah, I think so, yeah. yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah, 156 is pretty good, though. We had to earn those medals. It was not easy, trust me. We had some... Well, hey, you guys worked, listen, you guys worked hard for those. <laughs> yes, plus, it. plus it was hot. It was very Ooh. hot. Oh, I bet it was. Really? I, I wow. bet. And it's not usually wow. hot for me, but it, it was like 87 and hot and humid. They don't have air conditioning. Oh. Ooh, that's really bad. Yeah, it was hot. At least they had sweltered that, that whole time. Wow. I had a little fan, though, didn't I, Kelly? You did. <laughs> I'm such an old woman sometimes. <laughs> So if you guys want to hear some questions, we're getting quite a few questions yep. and hands raised. So let's see. Let's go to the chat and get some <laughs> questions. So um, let's see. Becca. Where's Becca? Oh, yeah. I'm right here. You want to ask your question? Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, I have two questions, actually. The first one is what was the hardest part about being in the competition in, in the bowling? And... My second one is how how did you feel when you found out that you were going to summer games? I bet it was like an amazing feeling to when they told us that we were going to actually go to Germany. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was like, hmm. I've never been to Germany, and I think I always wanted to go. Plus, my husband is from Germany, so I kind of wanted to go with him because he actually speaks the language. But he didn't get picked; I did. So. <laughs> I got to go and not know any German words. <laughs> yeah, I was cool. very happy and very excited. And I was super blessed to so, have Kelly as my partner. How did how did he get to like to be in contact with you? Did he get to like video chat with him or like or with um, my husband? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. The time difference though, we were ahead six hours. Oh so, okay. what time is it now? Like six thirty. So it's really twelve thirty. Twelve thirty. Yeah. So we had to make sure we called. In the in our evening would be your morning. So how long was the flight? Seven hours, I think. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wow. Yeah. I think we left at I can't even remember what time we left, but we got over there at 
seven o'clock their time. Was was the competition the next day? Was it like the day no, after? We, no, we went to the uh, another town, Bremen, for like three or four days, and then we went back to Berlin. Wow, what ceremonies! But like the next day, and then I think we didn't bowl until like two days after that. Did you get to see any sights? Yeah, we saw everything we could possibly see. Yeah. yeah. We bowled yep. on opening ceremonies before we went. Did? Yeah. Oh, Remember, we had a change at the bowling alley. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Deb blocked that part out. I did. <laughs> did you have to I did. That? We had to bring our clothes and change there, right? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Did you have to practice for that, though? Did you have to... For opening ceremonies? Yeah. I mean, like, yeah. I mean, no. But did you guys have enough time to practice for competition, I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, we practiced. Well, I found out when last August. So I had, like, a whole year to bowl. Oh, wow. Okay, then, so they don't... Right before Sometimes Christmas. people oh, take yeah. things at, like, the last minute, and then it's like, oh, my gosh, we got to rush. we got to do, like, all this preparing stuff, and it's like... No, Kelly and I both bowled, so we do know how to bowl. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, lots of questions. Thanks a lot, Becca. We're going to hop over to Dan Whiting next. Dan, what's your question? Uh, my question, I did you know I spoke German? You do? You? Yes, wow. I do, a lot of them. Uh, the reason why... And Hamburg, Germany, my mom and I went there, and I had a relative named the Whiting Ha oh, in German. Oh, and yeah. we find a will of one of my family. His name's Whiting Ha. Oh, nice. It's the, it's the most of background of him in Hamburg. What we did was go to the archives in Hamburg. You had to drive out of the city and they oh, wow. made a photocopy of a will from the 1100s, half Latin, half German, and it was fun. So nice. <laughs> it's the same, it's the same last name, but we don't know if it's a broad relative. But Weidinghof, which means a farm, was in Germany as well as in Sweden. So there we go. That's all. And mostly, <laughs> and mostly Swiss went to Germany between 30 years more there. And because we have followed Luther and Lovelstadt. And yeah. we followed Luther there. Yeah, we, we went in his footsteps. Say we went in his footsteps. So we went to his footsteps. Okay. Stop there. And, and I know you went to Berlin, Germany. And we went there. It's very, very <laughs> nice. <laughs> yes, we loved it. Okay. Thank you. Thank so you. Much, Dan. Appreciate it. Thanks, Carol. <laughs> <laughs> okay, welcome. let's hop over to Carly. Go ahead, Carly. What's your question? Did you know my grandparents grew up in Germany before they moved to New York to have my mom and uncle? Very good. So you got German descent in you. A little. Yeah, good. Thanks for sharing that, Carly. Actually, one of the reasons I asked um, Brandon to introduce you guys today is he was born in Germany, right, Brandon? Still there? <laughs> okay, let's go over to Ashley. Ashley, what's your question? Hmm. Were there any celebrities that performed at opening ceremonies? No. Kelly, who was it? <laughs> who was that? <laughs> the the who was what? The wrestler. Oh, oh. No. Hugh McIntyre. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh him. <laughs> Oh, him. oh, I should have known. <laughs> I personally don't watch wrestling. Don't hate me. me hey, Deb, neither do I. I'm not a fan either. <laughs> no, neither. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I mean, he was nice looking. He was very tall. <laughs> That's what I remember. I should have, yeah, yeah, yeah. And we okay. actually, 
the other celebrity that we met was besides Tim Shriver. Was, oh, I um, know Tim way back. I know. Um, oh, yes. Miguel Cordona. Yeah. He's the Secretary of Education. He works under President Biden. So he actually came and walked in with us during opening. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, oh, cool. I saw him at, at our state games. Yeah, he's from mm -hmm. Connecticut. Yes, I remember him. Wow. And my other question is, is what was your favorite part about being there? What was your favorite, Kelly? Um, Besides the pool. <laughs> <laughs> um, my favorite part was the competition and stuff and seeing all the... Uh, the sightseeing. Yeah, the sightseeing was good. I like the sightseeing. You know what I really, really remember and I'll never forget is walking into opening ceremonies mm -hmm. and having all those people in that big, huge arena clapping for us as we walked in. I swear That's there was amazing. a million people there, but there was probably only, I don't know, 25,000 for all I know, but I it was been, a lot of people. I would have been crying if I, if I was that, or if I were you. Mm -hmm. You'd be what? I'd be crying. I'm an emotional person, so I would have been. You know, I can't tell you that I didn't have tears in my eyes because there, there, it was something. That was something I'll never forget. Because I remember all the times you and I did like yeah. nationals together, Dad. That was fun. Oh, and that was a small arena. Picture right. this one, ten times bigger than that one. Oh, mm. I'm sure. Yeah. Answer your questions. Okay, who is weeping? Oh, all right, Ryan, why don't you go next? Where's Ryan? Go ahead, Ryan, ask your question. Okay, my, que my question is, uh, how many, how many group messengers attend the foreign oh. games? How many global messengers attended? Yes. From any Connecticut? I don't, think any, I don't think anybody from Connecticut, but they did have global messengers there. Berlin, Germany has their own, so they were up on stage with Tim Schreiber. Hmm. We actually had two <laughs> athlete leaders from our unified sports program from High School who were there. And we didn't we didn't see them. Yeah, I think they were separate. Yeah. Good question, Ryan. But Thank they you. had their own. And you know what else? One of the girls. <laughs> I think she's from the United States. She was um, a sportscaster with uh, ESPN. Oh, so I, who I did was. see her there. Yes. Yeah. I remember yeah, Kenny and I used to go way back. Thanks, Ryan. That was great. Okay, let's see. I think Robin had her hand up. Hey, Robin, where are you? I'm right here. Um, so being, uh, being the, uh, one of the people that went to Australia in May. Um, I know I'm so jealous of all your pictures. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I, just wanted to know. To go. <laughs> I just wanted to try uh, 24 hours on a plane and then yeah, how fun was that? <laughs> yeah, right. I, I just want to know how long you slept after. <laughs> Being, being in Germany for a week because I slept for four days straight after being in you mean when I came? Yeah. yeah you know when we got home our bodies were it was really like 2 a.m and then oh. I had to drive us home so then by the time I got home it was really my body is 4 a.m but I think it was like eight o'clock here at night or something like that I don't remember when I wow. how that but so then I couldn't go right to sleep. So then I have to tell my husband everything and show my picture. So I think by the, when I got here, it was really midnight, but it was like 6 a.m. in the next morning for me. So I think I was up 24 hours again. Yeah, Australia I can't was sleep four... on a plane or on a bus. So Neither I could not. Australia just... is 14 hours ahead in a completely different season. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. It's wow. the winter right now there, or it was in May. Wow. It still is winter in um, Australia. Yeah, it's not true. I think we, <laughs> they all have coats on. They were over there doing the women's soccer. The soccer was kind of near there. So they all had winter coats on. I'm like, oh, it must be winter. It is winter Robin, there. And I talked to Mary the other day, and she was freezing. Yeah. So it's cold <laughs> over there. They don't know what cold is, right? <laughs> it's, you know, I don't cold know. Cold. It's <laughs> <laughs> Mary puts a coat on if 
than 60 degrees outside. She don't know what cold is. Oh, yeah, no, that's short. Okay, Brittany, let's go to Brittany. She's got her hand up. Mm. Good, Britt. Have you ever had German cake? Oh, Have I ever had German cake? Hungry. Don't think so. <laughs> You've never had German chocolate cake? No. Yeah, there's a German chocolate cake. <laughs> yeah, we can make that here. <laughs> they had what they did for us because there were so many people at this hotel. I mean, they had to feed a thousand people there. So they just for their desserts, they made like little mini muffins. And we had those like were, those mini were muffins. Good. Those were good. We kind of made donuts were good. Like blueberry, chocolate chip. No, or? they were chocolate. Ah, no, I shouldn't chocolate have. muffins. Like chocolate cupcakes with no frosting. Right, right, yeah. I was going to tell you, um, next year, I'm experiencing a trip to Italy next year. Nice. So a longer flight. Me Don't too. Pour it. In, in October next year, I'm actually going to go to Italy. The must be my birthday. That sounds okay. fun. I've never been to Italy. Neither have I. It'll be my first trip, too. Good. Yeah, it's going to be my first trip, too. My brother has been there. Oh, my sister right. in law. But now it's my turn. Yep, my turn as well. All right, let's see who else has their hand up. I see Natasha with her hand up. Go ahead and ask your question, Natasha. Thank you. So, um, good evening, Natasha Cole. Um, I have three questions really, really quickly. Um, how long have you competed in the Berlin Special Olympics? Would you explain how you raised money in your team for the World Games, for example, equipment? Are you planning to have law enforcement officers attending your World Games in my in my state? In Connecticut, we had the same thing. Hey, that's a big question. Um the torch run did come lisa carlone you all know her oh nice nice she was over there her and her husband they <laughs> did we did not see them though we were going to meet up and we just didn't our paths did not cross but they were there and we saw them bring the torch in so oh, that cool. part same did we raise money is that your other question we had to raise money yes like for example like that since you part of the team like um how much um like funding did you have to use for your bowling e e equipment and your team search well yes. it well we didn't really well we had to raise money our own little bit of money but it wasn't for like all the equipment and the bowling we had our own bowling balls we brought those and mm -hmm. all the clothing came from the usa games so it wasn't specific from Connecticut. It was like the whole big USA Special Olympics. And we, one shirt. we did not <laughs> we did not have to bring any of our own clothes because we had so many clothes. Mm -hmm. And then for fundraising, we both had a profile picture that Special Olympics Connecticut put up and quite a few people donated to both Kelly and myself. Oh, thanks so much, Natasha. That was great. Okay, so it's on um, about 20 of. I'm, I'm going to let Aaron ask a question. I think if there anybody else that didn't ask a question yet, and then we're going to go to the questions that were submitted ahead of time because people really oh, don't have time okay. to do those. So let's okay. go to Aaron. What's your question, Aaron? All right. Well, I need to wake him up. He's sleeping. <laughs> no, I just, I just want to say to you two, Congratulations by being over there and experience experiencing a lot of stuff out there. And um, I also want to ask the question is when you guys when you guys got when you guys got on that plane, what was your first experience when you got on that plane and when you got off the plane and you got to well when you guys started where was the first place you guys started and then where you guys had to be in the parade for the um for the whole ceremony so what what was the best part of it go ahead kelly tell them our experience when we first got on the plane <laughs> the going no uh -huh. that was all you so you take it what i do don't you remember the name your name Questions. 
Oh yeah. My name was spelled wrong. On the oh. on the thing. How they spell it? So what so what happened? So they I, they had to get me a new ticket. And then So what so what was the name that they put in wrong? What, what name was it? Was it was the right name, but they had letters mixed up. So it was like instead of E I, it was I E. Oh. They spelled it wrong. Oh, so wow. Kelly and I were the very last people and to then, go downstairs oh. to the lobby that we were supposed to have. And, and then we got we worried. That, on the plane. And, <laughs> and you got worried. Because <laughs> nobody was looking for us. <laughs> yeah. so, that was not a fun experience right there. How did you handle we your luggage? There? Yeah, well, no, we had our luggage with us. So now when you got, okay, so let me ask this quick question and I'm going to let everybody else mostly take over. Um, when you got, okay, did you have to go pick her up to bring, bring, bring yourself and your partner to the airport the next day? Or did you guys like leave right after, like, did you guys leave when she got done with work and had to go to the airport and... Be ready for the next day to get on the plane for Berlin and everything else. So, or how how did that how did that work? Uh, go ahead, Kelly. We, we, met up, we met up somewhere. We met at the uh, Hamden office at Special Olympics. Okay. And then they, and then they got a car, and then they yeah. drove us to New York. So oh, nice. good. And well, then we stayed was... overnight at that what? TWA hotel, and then okay. the next day. We went right there. We actually walked over yeah. um, to, to get on the plane. Some the experience. Wow. So did so did the people so did the people did the, people, did, the uh, did the pilot like, uh, like introduce all you guys on the plane for for the USA Games for Special Olympics and everything else? And yeah, started clapping and everything else. Yeah. So. <laughs> the whole plane started clapping. Well, that's nice. amazing. Yeah, because it wasn't oh, the Olympics on the plane. There were other people on the plane. It was oh, a big of course. See, y'all should have been wearing this instead yeah. of having on there. You should have had the S on it. <laughs> we felt like our own celebrities, huh, Kelly? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Good. Well, like good old superstars, right, Deb? Yes. Yeah. Um, so I have a question. <laughs> I'm wondering if you met somebody in particular from a different country who impressed you or who you might keep in touch with now that the games are over. Oh, that is a good question. I don't think I did. Do states count? Yeah, how about a different, different state? state? That's a great question. <laughs> I met someone from wow. Maryland. Nice. Awesome. Wild. Wild. <laughs> what? I said, why are you laughing? God, he talks to me <laughs> all the time. <laughs> yes, we are now friends with everybody from our bowling team. There are a couple from Utah, North Carolina, Louisiana, Maine, Massachusetts, right? I, I think, think that, was, yes. that was the bowling team. So we're all friends on Facebook with them. And then actually Trisha's cycling team, we were pretty close with them. So we're friends with a few of them on uh, from the cycling team. Oh, different no, different I really forgot to ask. But actually, I don't yeah. think anybody actually, from a different country. Sorry. Ashley, there's a there's a thing on Facebook that well, there's a thing I have on Messenger. It's called I think it's called um hold on, let me look it up real quick and everything else. So I have it on I have it on here though and everything else. So um it's called Special Olympics with all the all the all the people not like all the all the sports style like curly cur curl coaches cheerleading bowling bocce basketball and I met I met like other people like say from other states though like for because uh, I, I I do softball with Unified Special Olympics with uh on Pete's team and I've been like Please Texas. Like, yeah. I, I've been doing I've been doing that for the last couple of days because I've been just been meeting people from like all from different states so and they were just showing like the medals and all that stuff and how 
how they how they done and everything on so what was the best thing about it though and everything about <laughs> and this is this is really good me. by using that though because that's the end of my hand. That's from... but that's all I, I have Sharon so one more question I'm gonna interject yeah, a little bit here so Kelly had a parade in her town when she came home. The whole town threw a parade for her. What was that, what was that like, Kelly? That, that was fun. Um, I, I I have pictures, right? I think it's at the end of your book. Yeah, it's easy to find. With the hometown hero. Yeah, see, that's me in the Jeep. Oh, my. Oh, you got to ride in a fun Jeep. It's so cool. I was standing up the whole time. Oh, I have your own little parade there. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that's neat. This was the fire department. Oh, nice. Oh, wow. the police. And then wow. the... Kelly, I forgot to ask, did you do, like, any pin trading with the other states or not really? Yes. You did pin trading. Because I remember with my experience, yeah. I used to do that, do that too. I well, actually did that too in 2014 because yeah. I also got pin yeah. for the track and field. And oh, I yeah. Pin. I forgot about all that pin trading. And I, and I remember how my mom told me how anything you did, you'll go to. So the first day, I scored Hawaii the first day. Mm. It seems like a lot of people must have went to the USA games. I'm the only one who didn't even go to the USA games. I went to well, like maybe you'll have to go to the next one. Yeah, what I haven't the one yet one yet either. I, where I think it's, why do I want to say it's in Minnesota? What's in Minnesota? I think the next USA games, I think. I think somebody told us that. I think you're wrong. Get Martin should know that one. The next world one is in Italy. Hmm. That's not hard trip. <laughs> okay, so I think we covered a lot of the questions that were submitted on um, Kimberly. So Carly had asked, what sport did you compete in? We covered that. Kimberly, um, let's see. Oh, Kimberly asked, did you learn any German words or phrases when you were there? Did you learn any German while you were there? Did, did we learn not? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is the truth. <laughs> You know what? We really didn't have to speak German over there because they, everybody speaks English. Great. So, Good. and their English is way better than our German. <laughs> Great. And I see another <laughs> question I don't think was uh, asked yet. Ali had wanted to know what are the people like there? Mm, just curious. Very yeah. nice. Everybody was very, very nice. And they speak good English there. Yes. Good. Yeah, hey. German. Okay, is there anybody uh, who didn't get a chance to ask a question yet that would like to? I want to make sure everybody has a chance. Albert, yeah, go ahead, Albert. Um, did you um did you interact with any of the global messengers? Were there lots of global messengers there? There was not a lot of global messengers there that I that I saw. I mean, I saw a few. They were up there during opening ceremonies and closing ceremonies. They were helping out at that. But I, I didn't, they weren't at the bowling. Thank you. Albert, you sent me another question earlier today that I think is a really good one. Do you mind if I read it? Go ahead. Okay. It says, how did you like performing Special Olympics in a foreign country of Germany? Is it different than uh, competing in the U.S.? Hotter. Oh, yes, <laughs> hotter? Yeah. It was hotter. <laughs> At least oh. our bowling alleys here have air conditioning. Theirs did not. Oh. Yeah, yeah the, the other day I went into the bowling alley and I was like, oh my God, it's freezing in here now. <laughs> oh. What was the weather? Oh. Was it hot? Cold? It was hot. Hot? 80s. High 80s. Wow. And then when we came, impressive. we came home on a Monday, and then the that Wednesday they had flooding, like three feet of water flooding. Wow! 
Yeah. Well, how'd you manage I, to escape? Ooh. I did. I, we did manage to escape. New Zealand, on the other hand, stayed at yeah. our hotel and they couldn't get out till Wednesday. So I'm going to assume they did not get out on that Wednesday until the flood flooding was. Must gone. have been a lot of rain then. Yeah. Like Tuesday into Wednesday. And we get, we left Monday. Mm. So we wow. just missed it. You're lucky. <laughs> You're did you? lucky. We did get rain though. Yeah, we did. Rain. A couple days. <laughs> I'm going to put us all together again so we can all just kind of. Chat and hand hand more waving. My hands waving. So when's the next World or National Games? I don't know that answer. Deb, I think it's Italy, isn't it? And yep, Italy is yes. the next one. I knew it. I knew it. So that'll be the Winter Games, right? And then, like we were saying before, Minnesota is the next USA Games. Yeah, I'll let you know. Ryan has his year. hand up. Ryan, why don't you go and ask your question next, please? Yeah, this is the last two. Uh, one, can you guys meet the Prime Minister of Berlin? We met the no, Prime Berlin. Minister of Germany, yeah. Minister. Oh, wow. Well, we okay. did. Yeah. Yes. And the last one is, how long was the flight? The flight was seven hours. Overnight. So we got there. Oh, seven in the hours. Yeah. Overnight. Thank you. But they had a big summer beach party for us out on the beach. Oh yeah, and Kelly tried on zip lining on the beach. <laughs> What'd you try? Zip lining. Zip lining. Oh my god, that's crazy! Wow. How was that, Cal? It wasn't that high, but it was on yeah, the because because they only got me a, a video of me falling off of it. Oh, were you no. okay? Yeah, I was oh, fine, I, but they didn't wow. get me doing the whole thing. <laughs> oh my goodness! Well, you had better luck than I would have done. <laughs> well, at least you weren't scared of heights, though. It wasn't that high. It really was not that high. <laughs> Did you try it, Debbie? Nope, I was not trying that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think I videotaped her. I got it on video. <laughs> Wonderful. Oh, I'd love to see the video of the whole thing if if Debbie wants since it's a copy. I don't know if I can get it up. Fine. Is this gonna cut off on us, Deb? You can share your screen if you want, or I can kind of spotlight you if you want to try to show something. Well, I don't know if I, is it. I'm just asking: Is your um, are you gonna is the Zoom gonna cut off on time? Yeah, no, time? yeah. Well, we, we usually wrap up within an hour. But it Let me see if I can find it. <laughs> Yeah. I have, I, like I said, I printed out 293 pictures. I don't know if I can find that in time. Oh, that was back in Bremen, wasn't it, Kelly? Yes. Go back to that. <laughs> That's cool. I'm very impressed with you guys' trip. That sounds like a wonderful time. It really, truly was. Let me see if I still have it. Yeah. This was my like, favorite place you had What's oh. that? Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Congratulations, oh. Kelly. Well deserved. Yes. Whoops. You know what? Yeah. Mute yourself. I just muted you by accident. I'm sorry. I was trying to spotlight you with your medal. <laughs> there you go. Oh, beautiful. Awesome. That's lovely. That was for her singles because she did bowling by herself. I don't have that video anymore. Oh. If you find it, we could send it to him after. So my, I'm wondering, but what advice this. would you give somebody who's going to a World Games? Oh, here, let's spotlight That's that. That's the Prime Minister. Oh, what, 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 what was his name? Uh, I can't remember. Oh. But he came that way. He came to the beach party that we had. Oh, lucky. Oh, lucky. Mm -hmm. we, went to we went to a German zoo. That was kind of fun. Oh, any wild animals? <laughs> they had a lot of wild animals, but they didn't speak German. Oh, God. <laughs> Kelly getting interviewed by the, um, the I don't know, some little news station that they had there. Oh, oh that's sure. impressive. I know. Oh, oh cool. I wish I was going to really cool. questions. Well, I kept all these on my phone. No. Oh, wait a minute. Where's Kelly? Here's Kelly making a wish on the uh, on the donkey. See the donkey, the dog. Yep. The cat, oh, the cat. one of those. Oh, I it's thought that's going. 
if you hold on to the bottom there where she's hanging on to his feet, she had to make a wish. Oh. <laughs> she never oh. did tell me what it was. Did your wish come true, Kelly? <laughs> she's not she's saying. So she's not <laughs> saying. <laughs> 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 well, anyway, Debbie, Horn, I got to get ready for dinner. Okay, does anybody have any last questions? I know we're coming up on seven o'clock. I want to be respectful. Jake, go ahead, Jake. Unmute yourself. Go ahead and unmute yourself, Jake. We'd love to hear your question. All right, it's unmuted. Okay. What time did you get on the flight? And what time did the plane arrive? And what time did you guys get home on the trip? Jake, how the heck are you? Do you remember me? Perfect. <laughs> Do you remember who I am? Gabby, yep, and Carly. Um, what time do we get on the plane? So going home? Yeah. Um, um, going to Berlin. Going to Berlin. I don't remember. I want to say it was like six o'clock, four o'clock. I think oh, it was around like four forty. Four forty. And then we yeah. got over there at seven something. Yeah. Yeah. Coming home when we left, we had to sit down the plane for an hour and a half before That's it even off. Wow. We got stranded a little? Yep, for an hour and a half on the plane, oh. on the tarp. Oh. And then all the people that had connecting flights missed it. Oh, man. And Wasn't then they there... got to stay another night at the TWA uh, hotel again. I think when Carly in Berlin. Must be a very nice hotel there. It, it was a very nice hotel. Mm, yeah. It really okay. truly was. Oops, go ahead. Okay, I just wanted to, um, it, we have like three minutes left. Oh, Ray, go ahead. Why don't you go ahead and ask your question? I just want to say, Kelly and Debbie, I am very, very, very proud of you for all your accomplishments yeah. in Berlin. Thank, Thank you. you. Congratulations. Congratulations, yes. You're very welcome. Very nice. Sure. And I love you, pictures. Thank you. I have so Thank many. many. I just didn't think I could share them all. But here's Lori Jean. I'll show you show you that. Oh, where is she? <laughs> oh, I love Jean. Oh, here. she is. Oh, oh, really? She looks great. I saw that one. Yeah. Look, I haven't seen there. her in a long time. I know. Oh, Same here. Good. I don't Did know if I know? count this I'm trying to go through fast. I should have thought earlier that you guys might have wanted to see more. Yeah. yeah. Well, give her my best when you see her next time. Well, I don't know if I'll see her anymore. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm sure I'll run into her on Facebook or something. I can tell her you said hi. Okay. I'll send her that to my too. Yeah. We'll I'll see you. All right, you guys, it's coming up on 7 o'clock, so let's give uh, Kelly and Deb a big round of applause, a show our appreciation yeah. for uh, joining Thank us today. Great work, great work. I'd also like to thank Brandon for doing an awesome job on the intro, mm -hmm. and of course, Mike Mason for joining us tonight as well. Oh, thank you, Mike. Thank you, Mike, for being thank on. You, thank you, Mike. Well, it was great to see you. Thanks, everybody. Mike. Yeah. And Deb, let me just say, if these are our global managers this time, you have a good group. Everyone <laughs> is very well spoken. Nice job. Thank you. We'll see ya. Okay, everybody, have a good night. Thanks again, Bye. Debbie. Bye. 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 Bye.